Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to what is today going to be a little bit of gossip. If you're new around here, make sure you're hitting that subscribe button, and of course, leaving the video with a like. So we have loads of Legion items, quite a lot of them will be coming to the game, and some of them will, of course, just be suggestions. But as always, here are a couple of the latest daily drops, so make sure you go along and grab these before they disappear. So, Undead X Doom arrives this Friday. Long story short, this is the latest upgrade package, so you will have to pay to win on this one although you're not really going to be winning but you will get a really nice set out of it with some really nice lightning effects however that is under the presumption that that is your kind of thing there also appears to be some other variants coming with it but as we always say around here time will just have to tell okay so showed you this set the other week from Bido, and we have a little update on it because we have an extra weapon to go along with it as you can see it looks like a different variant of the helm as well and you get a quite a cool spear with this set so this one should be coming for Deja's birthday and expect it to be in the chest next up we have an update on this set by Kartos and we also have a female version on the way as well. I'll of course show you that once I eventually spot it. The set itself is using that darker green colour along with the blue which we don't always see so much on Dage items nowadays but it's good to have it coming back as and when. Okay let's move on. Legion Warlord. This one not sure if it's confirmed for the game but again we have some different variants of this armour set and they are looking really cool so we could potentially see these released over a period of time but as I said I haven't seen anything to confirm that one and that is the same story with this one from Dino. Again a lot of these items you will expect to see they always seem to get added in however they do also sometimes just get added to suggestion poll and you'll see them pop up next year instead which has happened in the past so that could always be the same case this year round then we have lots of weapons to show you now these seem to be confirmed by the sounds of it which means we will have a little flick through the weapons so you can have a slightly closer up look at some of the ones you'll be able to get your hands on obviously as this one was a gift we could all but presume it was animated before I clipped it we also have these rather nice looking side as well as these kind of dual bladed weapons not too sure what I should actually call these ones I guess again we'll just have to see what they come into the game as we get another spear a couple swords dagger a nice looking bow as well to go with it now moving on we have this lucky day one again by Dino this is going on with a previously designed Mogloween set under a similar kind of theme so we'll just have to wait and see what happens with that one there and we also just because I'm quite into Yu-Gi-Oh wanted to show you what Terra did here with this Joey Wheeler Yu-Gi-Oh theme set which again quite cool I can't remember the last time we had Yu-Gi-Oh item but my memory is notoriously a bit of a sieve okay so Moz drew this one up last year this is the Death Knight set that I showed you and again it has been re-suggested so fingers crossed maybe we'll get our hands on it this year Slay, but certainly not least this one here by Christia I just wanted to show you this I came across it while I was browsing around I thought it was nice and it's nice to show off different artists as and when on the channel so Thank you all very much for watching. Please do leave the video a like and of course subscribe and I'll see you all again for another one incredibly soon. Until then, have a lovely day.